Dude, these things fight unreal. It's a nice fish. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. That's another dude, 30. That's over 30. That's yeah, it is. PB. That's my PB. Dude, that thing is long. Oh. Morning. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to NB Edits. Today, we are up here with our good buddy, Jacob Sweary. We are up in northern Wisconsin. A little bit different northern Wisconsin though this time. Today we are in Door County. Last night we got out here and absolutely hammered some big walleyes. It was downpouring rain most of the evening, very windy. It was brutal, but we manned it out for about probably almost 12 hours yesterday, I would say. We had ourselves a day. We definitely had some lull periods, but we got into some really nice fish. And today, it's fairly calm. We got a little wind, not as bad as yesterday, no rain. We're gonna go ahead, get the big cam out. We got the GoPro strapped up out here in the nitro. Today, we're gonna get hooked up on some big fish. We're out here early, it's time to make it happen. Well guys, we have made it out on the Atlantic Ocean and as you can tell, probably, probably cannot. Uh, we're the only boat out here. Not really sure why, because uh, this water holds giant walleyes. And I don't know why people wouldn't want to catch those. It's really not that bad out here. But that's besides the point. We have made it uh, close to the spot we ended the night on yesterday. And I'm going to go ahead, turn it around to the captain of the boat up here in the front. <sighs> Sweetie. Good morning. Would you like to tell the folks here at home how we are catching these walleyes today? Well, we're using uh, shiver minnows, jigging wraps, spoons. This is kind of a new thing we've been using. It's literally just a, they call it a bink spoon. Apparently pretty good out here. Caught a couple on it yesterday. And all we're doing is driving around on this big rock flat and basically just targeting pods of walleyes using the live scope here. Uh, we got the new deucer hooked up. Um, first time using it and we can shoot out about 110 feet. So it's pretty, uh, Hard to catch them, you could say. Oh, I just missed a goby. But yeah, that's about it. So hopefully we can catch something. As I'd mentioned earlier, we got out here yesterday and uh, caught some big fish. Now, someone may have connected with a 30 inch wall. I'm gonna go ahead and overlay the clip for you guys here so you can see what we were dealing with. Again, yesterday we had some overcast and uh, yeah, absolutely cracked day out here as i said we went through some lull periods but this guy jacob sweary hooked up with a 30 inch walleye and actually 30 and a quarter and uh, yeah it was an absolute mammoth so we're hoping to do the exact same thing out here this morning we've got no rain so we can actually bring out the big cameras and everything and i think we're gonna have ourselves a day all right well switching it up a little bit here got the old pc fun rods with us today tossing the old serpent rod I was throwing purple yesterday, and this morning I'm starting off with white. We're gonna see. We're gonna see how that uh, changes things. Like I said, got the old PC Fun Serpent Rod, and I've got that paired with a 2000 Series Honor XT, and uh, this is gonna do us dirty today. All right. Well, I'm gonna begin fishing. I've got like a red and orange shiver not sure of the size but uh got a few fish on this last night so this is what we're going to be starting with and for the setup brandon is using the honor xt like he was saying i am going to be testing out brand new reel from pc fun this is the auric 2000 series and so far actually after using this yesterday um i really enjoy it i use the carbon x manually all the time when i'm out fishing but this is a little lower gear ratio so i can pick up more line with this which is really great for the shiver minnow because you're constantly ripping it up and uh, when it's windy like this we're casting with the wind and then retrieving back so it's really nice to pick up more line really smooth drag works nice i did lose a couple fish but that was uh personal issues not because of the reel and uh hopefully today i can figure my stuff out and uh not miss any because Obviously, this is the land of giants, and every fish out here could possibly be my new personal best. So, kind of got to be cracked out here at all times, make sure everybody's on board, net duty, and all that good stuff. But, if you guys want to check out anything from PC Fun, either this new reel, or the Honor XT, or the Carbon X, or even the Serpent Rods, 
Uh, there will be a link down in the description to go to their website. And if you use code NBEDITS18, you can get 18% off all of your order, not just on this stuff. It can be anything on the website. So go ahead, check it out down in the description. NBEDITS18, save yourself some money, get yourself some cheap, nice, affordable rods and reels. And yeah, we're going to get fishing here. Hopefully uh, we can find them. Hopefully they're on the spot and somebody can catch a big one. Where it's hooked up. Okay, coming. Oh, we don't. Peter's well. Not dry, but it's pretty nice. Okay, it's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Oh, oh God. God. Probably like a nice 25, 6, something like that. Not a bad fish to start the day. Grab a picture and then we'll uh, let her go. Sexy man you, look at that thing. <laughs> oh my God, that just hit it on the down. Did that I hit it? Was freaking gnarly dude. Did that hit on the down? Yeah, on the fall. I just gave her a KVD freaking hook set right there. But you reeled into it. Oh yeah. Hey, I might need a net. We don't have a potato. What are you talking about? Be another good one. Didn't feel good at first, but now it's fighting like a dog. Oh, it's feeling heavy now. Dude, these things fight unreal. It's a nice fish. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. That's another dude, 30. That's over 30. That's yeah, it is. PB. That's my PB. Dude, that thing is long. <laughs> That is long. Okay. Holy crap. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh my god. All right, hold on. Oh um, my god. Keep this in the net. So we just caught his PB. Here, throw this in the water. Hold it. Hold that in the water. Uh, I need to find a measuring tape that's longer than 30 inches. That's a predicament. Wow, tough problem to have, huh? Okay. Um, I need. To we should just be filming Sweary, our guide here, because he obviously is cracked beyond belief. We don't know what we're doing. I need to get in here. Okay. I think I've got a 50 right, inch on your rod. Tape in here, I think. I have a wrappable one. Oh, here it is. Here it is. All right. It's Northern Door County. Absolute giant fish. Oh, dude. That's got to be 31. I'm thinking so. We're going to put it on the bump board. Oh my. And I'm pretty sure my bump board only goes to 30 inches. Well, it's 30. It's 30 for sure. A little over. We'll put it on the tape. We're pretty much 31 almost. Pinch tail. Oh Pinch tail 31. My. 31 inch Northern Door County <laughs> stud. Oh Let's go. All right, I want to grab a couple picks quick, and then we're gonna get this guy back right away. Door County, 31 inch. He wants to go. Oh my, that was so aggressive. Let's go. That was so aggressive, dude. That was he was <laughs> on the fall. Let's go, baby. Woo. Okay, well, Swear's cracked out of his goddamn mind. Uh, Brandon and I are still just, you know, we're easing into it. Um, but Swiri is our guide, so I would expect nothing more. But that's two 30s in the last, like, eight hours of fishing. And if you combine the actual fishing time versus sleep time, I think it was, like, an hour and a half, two 30s, technically, of fishing time. Yeah. But <laughs> absolutely insane. Um, I switched to a uh, jigging wrap now, even though he's using a smaller shiver. But 
my god it seems like they're a little more tight together today yesterday they were spread out a little bit more today they're like small groups but if you cast directly on their head like that one hit it on the fall absolutely insane 31 inch fish got to get back out there brandon and i got to hook up and catch one of these things as well as a horse. Calm as a horse. There we go. Whew, not 30, but gold. Oh, she's dude. gold. Holy <laughs> gold. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> We're doing all right out here this morning, to say the least. Green Pulled up gold. on a big old pot of fish, and uh, yeah, all three of us actually went up to the front pulled up on the live scope saw a big pot of fish probably probably 20 fish i would say at least and uh this one came up and choked it so love that i'm gonna say it's probably about 26 and a half maybe 27 very nice fish super dark colors thick fish that is awesome wow yep <sighs> definitely some quality fish out here this morning that is awesome a little bit different area but still some northern wisconsin gold see a big girl Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's get another one. Wow, that was close to the boat. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Dude, what the? <laughs> 28 and a half incher. Oh, my, that thing is just real. another stud. Yeah. Unreal. We are gonna let this guy go right away. There he goes. Down. Finally, I am hooked up. Just do its thing. That's pretty oh, big. Baby. That might be your 30. Oh, wow. Be close. Frickin' came out too. They never are frickin' hooked very well with these things. <sighs> all time. I waited all day for that. Go ahead and grab the old bump board. What do you think? What's your guess? Probably at least 49 and a half. Probably. 29 and a half. 28. 
almost three quarter. Almost 29. Well, nice. it ain't no 30. I'm not blessed enough like Sweary yet. <laughs> but we just pulled back to the OG spot. And uh, 28 and three quarter, probably nine pound fish, at least old. This thing looks beat up, super heavy, great fight, super gold. And uh, yeah, the last four hours of fishing without a fish, and uh, this is worth it for sure. I mean, we are having a good day out here. Our bag would be absolutely insane um, currently with five fish, but it's a nice fish. Gonna grab a few pictures and uh, not put too much stress on this fish and get it back. Oh. <laughs> Maybe? Come on. Uh oh. Uh oh. There she goes. Well, not the best release in the world, but. Uh, just cut that out right when she came. <laughs> it went. That's all that matters. Hey, buddy. That felt good. That felt that good. good. Let's get nice. another. Yep. I think it's small. Is it? What's going on? I think it's small. Or it doesn't know it's supposed to be? Yep, correct. <sighs> Maybe not small. Wow. Shook it right off. Okay, at least you weren't sure on the way to Not like you hooked it. Like well, I was once it got close to the boat. It was really heavy. <laughs> well, guys, it's been a while since we've picked up the camera, and that is because, uh, well, we're back at the landing now. Uh, fishing has been slow the last couple hours and Brandon and I have to actually get back home because uh, in all honesty we gotta go play volleyball in a volleyball league. That's why we're <laughs> leaving but. Hey, we're heading home today. Potential 30 inches out there but we got volleyball to play so. Yeah, priorities are definitely straight but a uh, big thank you to Sweary for taking us out. He's actually staying up here for the next couple days so if you guys want to, well one, watch the videos that he film today and then hopefully maybe see the rest of the days i don't know if there will be any more but either way you guys should go down in the description check out his youtube channel and whatever else all of his socials we'll put it down in the description make sure go check him out and uh, we do appreciate him taking us out in his uh sexual nitro and getting on top of some big walleyes i mean this was a fun trip I wish we could have filmed yesterday's adventure just because uh, we did just as good with just the same size of fish. But yeah, that's basically all I got. Brandon, what do you got to say about yeah. the trip? It was uh, a lot of highs and lows. Lots of highs and lows. I mean, we got out here and definitely clapped some fish, but there were there were some moments where uh, it got tough, boys. It got real tough. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. The boys were down, and it's and it's hard to be down because. On this trip, guys, we had so many nice fish. I mean, Sweary had a what, 30 and a quarter and a 31. I mean, how can you even, how can you complain, right? But we went hours and hours and hours grinding for those fish. So it was fun to be up here. Beautiful place to be. Sweary's got some lunch and he's got some more fish to clap. We're gonna go home and uh, try to enjoy what's left of this weekend. And yeah, we have to go play volleyball. What the heck is wrong with us, dude? <laughs> All right, guys. Well, hey, thanks so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash that thumbs up button for us. Leave a comment down below of what you guys thought and what you guys want to see more of in the future. We'll see you on the next one. Tight lines from NBS. <laughs>